Bedtime Stories A first book of fairy tales Stories retold by Mary Hoffman Illustrated by Julie Downing The Princess and the Pea There was once a prince who was looking for a wife Only a real princess would do and he was very fuzzy about what she must be like. He went on long journeys to find the right one. But every princess that he found had something wrong with her. One has bad tempered. One was too tall. One wore silly clothes. And one had too many dogs. Then one night, in the middle of a terrible storm, there was a knock at the castle door. Outside stood a very wet and bedraggled girl, who said she was a princess. She suddenly didn't look like one. The queen had an idea. We'll soon find out whether she's a real princess or not, she said. I have a test that will prove it. She found a hard dried pea. Then she invited the girl to stay the night. After the girl had been given a hot bath and a dry night dress, she was shown into a splendid bedroom. But the queen had to put the dried pea on the bedstead and ordered the servants to pile twenty soft mattresses on top of it. In the morning, the poor girl said she had had a dreadful night. I was so uncomfortable, she said. There was something hard in the bed, and I tossed and turned all night. What a sensitive creature, said the prince. Only a real princess could feel a pea through so many mattresses. So they married and lived happily ever after. As for the pea, it was put in a glass case in the palace museum. And you can see it there to this day. A first book of fairy tales. Stories retold by Mary Hoffman. Illustrated by Julie Downing. The Princess and the Pea.